Question 16. Take one minute to complete this and then let's see what you get. All right, I've trust you have paused the video and did it. What did you get for the answer? Let's try it out. In the figure, triangle BAC, BAC, remember the angle is right where the middle letter is, BAC is 90 degrees. This little box here already shows 90 degrees, so they wouldn't have to write the, nine, the, the, the number 90 here. Angle ACB. So remember this little tick, crooked um, figure. It means triangle. It means angle. Angle ACB. That's ACB. Is 37 degrees, and BC, the length of BC, is 10 centimeters. The length of AC in centimeters is, so you want AC, this is what you want. Now, this is the angle. The angle is on the right, on my right. This side, AB, is on the left. In other words, it's on the opposite side of the triangle. So this is my opposite. AC is running right alongside, that is adjacent to the angle, 37. So this is our adjacent. Alright? Now, you have adjacent then you have hypotenuse. You're not interested in the opposite. You don't have a value for the opposite and they don't ask you for it. So you're not interested in it. So you can forget about this for now. What you're dealing with is adjacent, which you want, and the hypotenuse, which you have. If you remember your um, quote, the, your, your sine ratios, I think they have this thing they call sine or opposite over hypotenuse so cosine is adjacent over hypotenuse ka. tangent is opposite over adjacent you have to remember the ratios because um i don't believe they give you no the uh, uh, formula sheet for paper one unless they plan to start doing that soon but here the angle is 37. We want the adjacent and we have the hypotenuse. We're not interested in the opposite, so sine is not going to be our concern. Tan is opposite. Mm -mm. We're not interested in the opposite. We don't have it. We don't want it, so we're not using tan either. It's cosine. Cosine is adjacent to our hypotenuse. So cos 37 is the adjacent AC divided by the hypotenuse 10. Cosine of 37 is adjacent side AC divided by the hypotenuse. Remember the hypotenuse is the side that doesn't come anywhere near the right angle. It is opposite to the right angle. Alright? It doesn't come anywhere near the right angle. This one kind of rubs the side of the right angle. AB also does that. But BC is far from it. So that is a hypotenuse. 10. And if I should transpose for AC, what I could do is put this over 1. Alright. And then do a little cross multiply. Or I could say AC by 1 is equal to 10 times cos 37. So AC by 1 is just AC. is 10 cos 37. So... I have 10 cos 37, seem like B. I could also, in, a, in addition to cross multiplying, you know, I could just say I multiply both sides by 10. 10 cancel 10 and leave AC. AC equals 10 by cos 37. Alright? So the answer, looking at it in different ways, the answer for question 16 is B. Was that what you got? Alright? So, if that wasn't what you got, 
hope you understand what's going on at this point.